Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you with me today? Quickly because of time. Romans chapter 8 verse 29. Romans chapter 8 verse 29. Somebody this year, there shall be an unusual expansion for you. There shall be breakthrough in your destinies. There shall be breakthrough in your life. Romans chapter 8 verse 29. For whom he did for known, he also did predestinate to be confirmed to the image of his son that he might be the firstborn among many brethren. Shout of God, that is a prophetic word for you today. Do you know that before you were born, God had known you even before you were born. What you are going to be in the future, God already knows. A shout of God, there are forces and there are powers that will not allow you to fulfill destiny. Even when God has destined you, even when God has foreordained you, there are still certain things that say, no, you can't become. But today, I am glad to announce to you, by the name of Jesus, whatever God wants you to be, you will become it. Yes, 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 yes. Whatever God wants you to be, that is who you will be. Yes, 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 yes. Nothing can reduce your glory. Nothing can reduce your destiny. If you believe, let that amen thunder. Child of God, I want you to know there is a purpose why God created you. There is a reason why God created you. It's an error at the age you are now. You have not started fulfilling destiny. It is possible for you as a child of God who God have loved, who God have ordained, who God have predestinated, and yet you are still shallowing in an uncompleted destiny. It's very, very much possible. But I want to announce to you today, if you believe God, that he has given you purpose, if you believe God, he has given you mandate, this year, you should begin to pursue the mandate. You should begin to pursue the purpose. A little step upon little step. You are coming to a place of fulfillment. Somebody say amen now. Many lives have been diverted, but God is correcting it today by his hand. Many destinies have been shifted, but God is recorrecting it today. Many business have been taken, God is restoring it today. Many finance have been taken, God is restoring it today. If you know God restores, you say amen three times.